The BJP MLA Raja Singh has written to Hyderabad collector to ban the film Padmavati in the city. T Raja had earlier warned of setting himself a blaze if the film releases. So this is really going to another level with the Telangana BJP MLA now writing to the collector seeking a ban on the film's release Padmavati which is already embroiled in a massive controversy with several states uh, seeking the same. Ashish Pandey joins us for the very latest on this. Ashish, uh, tell us more. What exactly has the MLA written in his letter to the collector? Uh, so, uh, currently, right, like you can see uh, behind me, uh, the MLA is outside uh, collector office, Hyderabad collector office in Airbase uh, with his supporter. He has written, uh, he has submitted a representation to uh, Hyderabad collector, asking and requesting him to not to screen. Uh, movie uh, in Hyderabad uh, municipal jurisdiction, the Greater Hyderabad municipal jurisdiction, the movie Padmavati. Uh, Raja Singh in, in his letter has cited uh, example of Madhya Pradesh as well as Rajasthan government where the movie is banned. He has said that since this movie is uh, somehow uh, uh, affecting the sentiment of a particular uh, caste of, of, of Hindu religion as well as Hindu sentiment, that's why this movie should be banned. Uh, that's the demand. Uh, uh, the BJP MLA is uh, is uh, making and uh, now he has submitted uh, a letter to Hyderabad collector. Now we have to wait and watch what government of Telangana and the uh, collector of Hyderabad takes a uh, decision on this. Uh, so far, uh, the MLA has earlier also uh, made a serious, uh, 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 they, they, he had uh, protested seriously against the, this movie and had said that if any theatre in Hyderabad will explain this movie. He'll he'll the first person to burn down or raise down that theatre. So have BJP MLA is completely up and ante against the movie Padmavati, and he has now submitted uh, a letter of representation uh, to Hyderabad collector. Right, Ashish, just stay on with me uh, on this raging controversy surrounding Sanjay Leela Bansali's uh, periodic drama Padmavati, and let's also take our audiences uh, through the kind of reactions coming in from the various states who have joined the anti-Bansali chorus. Well, with the Padmavati Rao growing stronger with each passing day, various chief ministers and states have even joined the anti-Bansali film chorus. In fact, Rajasthan has now written once again to the INB ministry seeking a ban on the film's release till the objectionable seal are not removed from the film. So that's Vasundra Raje uh, government stand. First, in fact, they wanted a jury to see the, uh, the entire film, but now they have written to the IB ministry seeking a ban on the film's release. In Uttar Pradesh also, uh, Yogi Adityanath is fearing that there would be a law and order situation in the state and therefore he too has requested for the controversial scenes to be removed and in the other state of Madhya Pradesh Shivrat Singh Chauhan the chief minister has made it very clear that the movie will not be released in the state of Madhya Pradesh once again citing law and order uh, situation West Bengal however has uh, come out backing the film saying that this is uh, the time of a super emergency Mamta Banerjee throwing her weight behind Sanjay Leela Bansali's periodic film Padmavati and after West Bengal Karnataka in in fact, is the only one state that has also backed uh, not just the filmmaker Sanjay Leela Bansali, but the lead actor of the film, Deepika Padukone, who will be playing the role of Queen Padmavati. Siddharamaya has now demanded security for Deepika Padukone in the wake of fierce criticism, threats to her life. Uh, he has asked for security not just for the superstar, but even for her family members as well. Thanks for watching the video. For more such news and updates, please like, share and subscribe to India Today. Also check out our other great videos from our channel. We know you would love to.